got you live from Bastrop, Texas. This is Top Concepts. Okay, we are done with the tile installation here on the wall, ceiling of the shower. Uh, so what I'm going to do now, I'm already started, I am grouting the ceiling. Uh, it's pretty, pretty difficult. Uh, grout likes to fall down, so you can't really do anything about it. Uh, all the holes need to be filled with grout as well as the grout joints. So we're going to wipe everything, every square inch with the grout and we will sponge it off using a tile sponge and water. So uh, just to get you going, just kind of go over your grout joint a little bit. You're going to have some that fall. You drop a lot so you can pick it back up off the floor. Use it again, but it's all on your head. I'm on a step ladder right now. Be sure you get everything pushed in all the way through the whole grout joint. So when you start seeing it get pretty dry like this, when you see the color start to get chalky, be a pretty good time to start wiping it off. Okay. Now that I have about half of my ceiling grouted, I'm going to come back and I'm going to start cleaning the grout off of the tile. So what I do, I've got a bucket of water and I have a sponge here. So what I'm going to do, I'm going to go ahead and start in the corner and I'll put my sponge flat and I'll make a wipe with it. And I'll turn my sponge over and make another wipe. Once you make two wipes with a sponge, unless you want to use the edges, you need to go ahead and rinse it. And the darker the grout, the harder it is going to be to get your sponge rinsed out. And you'll have to change your water quite a bit. So now I'm going to come back, have a clean sponge, wipe again, turn it over, wipe again. Wipes and I rinse. Another way you can do it. Get the sponge, go ahead and wipe, wipe it all down this way. What this does, this is going to spread the grout. all over your tile, uh, push it up in the holes, everything, everything is wiped down, it should wipe off easier now, so there we go, let's get this edge here, there it is, you got the chiseled edge, looks good, and as you're doing it, if you see any little holes, you can come back and fill it in. And I'm gonna go around these edges as well. It's pretty plain, and we're gonna come back after we get everything wiped down good. In the end, we'll wipe everything down again. It's called final rinse, but you just don't want to let any grout dry on top of the tile. We got the ceiling grouted now. Um, this is what you want yours to look like when it's said and done. And then the walls are going to look the same way. Uh, you don't want to leave grout hanging over the edges. You want to be sure you have a little dip going in. And yeah, I think that's pretty good.